Hello everyone, it is Tom with the SS Motion back here today with another Call of Duty Mega Bloks review for you guys. And today we're taking a look at set number 06854 Sniper Unit. It is for ages 10 and up, and it includes approximately 136 pieces. So, as with the Jungle Troop Pack, this unit is mainly dedicated to the figures. So, we're going to start with them from the right and work our way right down to my left. Okay. So the first figure we have here is a generic soldier character in urban camouflage, a mix of urban and desert, with a unhelmeted head. This is the same head sculpt as in the claw, with different paint applications. A nice tan brownish coloured vest with a grey ammunition clip. Grey leg strip and grey concussion grenade and a grey pouch on the back and he includes a grey and silver sniper rifle next up we have the character wearing the brand new bonnie hat boonie hat sorry this is really cool let's give that a minute to focus there you go has a silver knife on a black leg strap grey claymore a grey ammo pouch give that a moment to focus and a metallic blue slash grey vest giving you a better look at that brand new head sculpt now you can see it's very nice and the boonie hat is really cool and he includes a black and grey sniper rifle ok so we have our third character He comes with a black tactical vest, grey water canteen, tan slash dark brown leg strap, and a tan ammo pouch. Pretty cool figure. Includes a tan sniper rifle. We then get our next figure. Probably my favourite of the set. Tan mask with grey goggles and a black cover. -up. Looks really cool. Grey torch. Silver flashbang. Tan vest and tan legs to match. Looks really nice. And a silver Desert Eagle style pistol. Nothing on the back of this one. And then lastly the kind of commander of the unit. We get the capped helmet, a long last in black, which is very nice. Give that a minute to focus. With a grey concussion grenade, a grey radio, the lighter design vest in tan, silver revolver piece, and a pair of grey binoculars. So as you can see, all the figures are in urban drab and they look very, very cool. Other accessories we get, if I stand him back up for you guys, we get a grey shovel, or entrenching tool, and this brand new grey spotting device that snipers use. Is that going to focus? Lots of nice detail on it, and it actually splits into two parts, as you can see here. So again, like the Jungle Troops, we seem to get a lot less accessories than before, but I don't mind it too much as the figures themselves are cool, and we get some nice new pieces like the boonie hat, the unhelmeted head, and really the black cap is nice. So as well as that, we get a little concrete jersey barrier. Looks really cool, smooth on top nice simple build which consists of six pieces it's really cool it's quite effective fairly decent height could probably be a bit taller but that's easy to modify and then last but not least we have this small cornerstone structure a couple of sandbags some details you've got both smooth bricks and uh, I'm not sure how to describe it, they're like rounded to make them look old 
which is quite cool. Nice smooth piece on top. It's quite easy to pose figs around this. Just knock them all over. So overall, it is quite a nice set. I like how we actually see a change of what's included in this set. We don't get some standard base plate. We actually get something quite different and quite nice this time around. And it is just a very, very nice set for the price. I would definitely recommend it as you get free of the new sniper rifle piece. Uh, you get the new spotting device and you get a lot of nice accessories. You also get a revolver, which is always good. And the structure and the pieces included in building it are epic. So that has been another review for you guys. This has been the Sniper Unit set. I hope you've enjoyed it. And until the next time, have a great week.